Since 2020, nearly $20 million have been dedicated to the Midway community to improve quality of life. Most recently, a $10 million investment from the American Rescue Plan Act. The ARPA funds coming in from the federal government gave us the, uh, the opportunity to boost forward the work that was already being done and get it to actually take place in a shorter, much shorter period of time than would have previously been allowed. Improvements are slated for everything from sidewalk installations. This is the main street sidewalk. To repave basketball courts and new playground structures with shade. They, they don't make them like this anymore, let's put it that way. But the most significant improvements are focused on alleviating the drainage issues. All of these are drainage improvements that would need to be um, done Flooding and standing water, frequently a concern due to low-lying streets and surrounding developments on higher land. First, taking care of drainage. Let, let's call that like it is. That's the basis of making sure that the community makes sense in terms of how you live and function every day after a rainstorm. And right now, it's not wonderful. And in some areas, it's pretty bad. The work extensive to go from this to a completely new network of piping, runoff structures, and ultimately ponds for water storage. This is a major retrofit project. Um, it will include over 14,000 linear foot uh, of, uh, of pipe, about 4,000 uh, re-cutting and reshaping of ditches. It will involve more than uh, 50 structures. So by doing all of that, it will be really, uh, it will help you know, enhance the drainage in the community. New drainage systems, new sidewalks, new playgrounds with shade and repaved basketball courts, new Florida friendly landscaping on State Road 46 and State Road 415, and the potential for a much larger future park and trail off of Brisson Avenue, the current location of a fenced off retention pond. Now that's about an 89 acre lake that currently has a fence all the way around it. We're looking at this project as being Seminole County's next great park. Um, there's a fantastic opportunity here with a community asset that right now really no one has access to. All that work is just beginning in the Midway community. Right now actually the design has started and you'll start seeing surveyors going in the community to take some survey shots and um, to collect some data. So you'll start seeing that this is actually happening. It's going to be a little bit of pain before there's a lot of gain.